Time is running out for candidates to deliver their message to voters. Early voting set to begin next week. This evening, Senate hopeful Beto O'Rourke is teaming up with CNN to host a town hall in McAllen. That's where we find our Mike Jimenez. Mike? Well, good evening, Brenda. Tonight certainly is a big night for Bethel here in the Rio Grande Valley. I'm here in front of the McAllen Performing Arts Center, where that town hall will be taking place at 6 o'clock this evening. Now, tonight's town hall will be a live moderated one hour event. The event is being hosted by CNN and will be moderated by Dana Bash. The press will not be allowed inside the town hall, but there will be an audience, which we're told by CNN those guests were invited to participate in tonight's town hall. Now, earlier this afternoon, Beto held a press conference along with Los Tigres del Norte here in McAllen at the Casa del Palmas Renaissance Hotel. Los Tigres officially gave their endorsement of Beto for U.S. Senate, and the group will be joining Beto after tonight's town hall for a concert event, which will be taking place at the Burt Ogden Arena at 7.30. We asked Beto how he felt ahead of tonight. This is our chance uh, to lead and to be there by and for one another. So a very positive campaign for the people of Texas so that we can help lead this country. Now, the town hall is not open to the public, but News Center 23 will be here for the event and we'll bring you all the latest details at 10 o'clock. Reporting here in front of the McAllen Performing Arts Center, I'm Mike Jimenez for KVEO News Center 23. Mike, thank you. Tonight's event, Adelante con Beto y los Tigres del Norte, is being held at the Burke Ogden Arena with special guest Asleep at the Wheel and Little Joey La Familia. It's open to the public. Doors open at 630.